You're watching EAC News. Thanks for joining us. Uncle International Airport is set to open in October. The Secretary of State of Civil Aviation has announced the inauguration of Sinrip Uncle International Airport on October 16, 2023, situated in Sotolukum District, approximately 40 kilometres from the city of Sinrip. The airport promises to serve a major gateway to its renowned tourist designation. The notification issued on the 27th of July 2023 informs national and international air transport operators, as well as the public, that the international airport located in Kleopong Village, Pompel Commune and Preville Village, Tapak Commune, Sotnikum District, Sinrip Province, has been officially named Sinrip Angkor International Airport. According to Sin Chan Srevelta, the spokesman of civil aviation, Sinrip Angkor International Airport, has received its official IATA code, SAI, from the International Airport Transport Association and its ICAO code, VDSA, from the International Civil Aviation Organization. Sinrip Angkor International Airport assumes full responsibility for handling all passenger and air cargo flights presently operating from Sinrip International Airport. This seamless transfer will take effect from midnight Cambodian time ahead of the official opening. Sinrip Angkor International Airport will conduct a series of test flights as needed, non-commercial and non-profit between October 5th and the 15th of 2023. Ms. Chai Sevelin, president of the Association of Travel Agents of Cambodia, highlighted the significance of the new airport for the future of tourism in Cambodia. She emphasised the importance of enhancing the confidence of tourists by utilising knowledge, skills and professional ethics to complete the attraction visitors to the region. We have been working closely with airlines and other stakeholders to ensure everything is in place for the transaction, said Sin Chansray Vuta, spokesman of the State Secretary of the Civil Aviation. The construction of the airport began in 2018 and was originally scheduled to be completed in 2021. However, the project was delayed due to COVID-19 pandemic. Anthony Ellis, EAC News.